He was not among the high flyers at KL last week, but Marco Crespi was in good spirits. The 35-year-old Italian got the monkey off his back three weeks ago by winning his maiden title in Spain, 12 years after turning pro. I worked a lot for, for this, and uh, now I'm enjoying uh, my first year on the, on the European Tour, and that's amazing for me, you know, and also uh, to win on the first season like a rookie, yeah, my story is pretty impressive. Narrowly missing his card through the Challenge Tour last season, Marco proved that perseverance can pay off by claiming the third card at Cusco. It was the 11th time he'd faced this most grueling of examinations and the first time he'd emerged successful. It's a pretty different uh, tournament. It's not a tournament. It's uh, like a war. You have to stay focused for six rounds. And uh, even if you play bad uh, the first round or, or the first two rounds, you know that you got four more to reach the top, to, to get your card. So what does a committed and industrious Italian do when he's captured his playing credentials? I drove to Italy for 900 kilometers just thinking about this. Oh, I got my card now. I got my card. Oh, yeah, I'm a European Tour player now. Exactly. It's, yeah, it's uh, pretty exciting. And it was to get even more exhilarating. Having begun his season with a tie for fourth at the South African Open, come a sunny Sunday in April, Crespi won the inaugural NH Collection Open in Cadiz, and joy was unconfined. A win always surprised me. I knew that uh, some, something was coming, and uh, I was expecting like a, a top five or top ten. Uh, anyway, when you win, uh, is uh, always a special thing. If you told me last year, at this time, that uh, now I was a European Tour Tournament winner, uh, I can laugh about it. Having dedicated his precious victory to wife Elena and daughter Carlotta, Marco also attributed his performance to the experience of playing alongside established stars in Johannesburg. I played with players such like uh, uh, Schwarzel or Annie Otto, who is at the top of the world. And uh, I, I saw that I can stay there. So that, that gave, me, gave me a lot of uh, confidence. With an exemption until the end of 2015, the oldest rookie to win in European Tour history can now look forward to teeing it up at the lucrative Volvo Golf Champions next season. This tournament as well, I, I, it, wasn't, it wasn't in my schedule. Uh, but now the, the prize money of the, of the tournament I'm going to play are bigger. And that's better for me and, and for, also for my uh, for my race to Dubai thinking. Marco Crespi, the man from Monza, having taken a big step towards better things on the European Tour.